Welcome back again YouTube. Nick the Kid here with another Mazda video. So this is my 2012 high mileage Mazda 3. Wanted to show you guys an issue that I currently have with my Mazda. This is an example of rotor warping. As you can tell there with the rotors are pretty old looking. Uh, last time I got them swapped out I want to say was 2019 summer of 2019 i believe so they're definitely due for a change inclusive with the brake pads as well this is a uh, rotor warping so unfortunately the pad wasn't wearing properly and it only stretched within the limits of what you see there but the pads should be reaching near or at least close to the edge of the rotor which that is a significant gapping there of like probably a quarter inch gap so that's not good so that causes my steering wheel to shake and if i can get the angle in there right so you could see the uh the metal on the pad or the metal there and then the second half that's touching the rotors there, that's what remaining pad wear that I have left on the pads. So my guess is that with that look, um, probably got about maybe 15% life left on the pads there. So I plan on getting the pads and rotors done on all four tires um, coming up this spring. So I got to save money for that. But unfortunately, the downside to this warping causes my steering wheel to shake every time I press the brake pad. So it significantly shakes quite a bit. And this is the only issue that I have of this particular brake pad. So please let me know in the comments down below if you think it's just a brake pad issue. And it just wasn't un uneven wear on the brake pad. Or if you think it's a possible caliper issue which i'm hoping not because the calipers are pretty expensive so anyway if you've had this issue please let me know what uh, results you found and let me know in the comments down below and again like i said these are pretty old pretty shot um worn rotors like i said was done back in 2019 so anyway hit that like button subscribe down below and eventually come the springtime when i do get these swapped out i'll end up showing you guys what the new pads and rotors look like so anyway see you next time